Search and Infinity just revealed some crucial details about the project that they're working on for Halo Infinite, and it's massive. In a recent Games Beat article, they talk about why Blizzard veteran Paul Sams is taking the COO job at Search and Infinity. And most of this article, it's him talking about like why it's great, Search and Infinity is amazing, and all this other kind of stuff. But they actually provide some information about the secret Halo project that they're working on right now. And this is their biggest project that they're actually taking lead on, saying that the biggest thing we're doing that's public right now for more than two years now we've been working on halo infinite doing something that they're very prescriptive about what they can say and he says that they're doing lead development on the unannounced thing from conception and design it's something big and new for the franchise and that it's certain Infinity's single largest project of our three projects currently we have close to 100 developers working on that which sounds about right as they did mention previously that they are doubling down on the support of Halo Infinite. Certain Infinity has been supporting 343 and Halo Infinite as a game for the whole time, but we know they're all referencing to Tonka, right? This new central article originally leaked out this information back on January 29th about this Certain Infinity building a new game mode for Halo Infinite and how this new mode that they're working on is supposed to be something that brings in new players and kind of compete along with Fortnite, Apex, and Call of Duty, which all those games are battle royales. Now the reason why Tatanka is rumored to be a battle royale because this this wrestler right here from the classic WWE days named Tatanka was the first wrestler to win the Battle Royale in WWE. With recent leaks suggesting that it will have your standard kind of Battle Royale experience with triples, quads, and they say a third person test mode, and also some free for all version would just be like solo queue Battle Royale mode for Halo, which would be pretty awesome. This other Tatanka leak suggests different types of gameplay mechanics like a down state, they have a drop sequence, gear cache, these different objectives called operations, which was a capture, a destroy, a horde, and a supply run with also storm bounties, weapon upgrades, and things like that. Also in certain Infinity says they have over 100 people working on the project. It makes you kind of think, okay, what does it take to really run a battle royale? Well, Raven Software, who is currently the main developers of the battle royale for Warzone, currently have a total of 350 employees as of 2021. And yeah, Infinity Ward creates the entire game mode, but Raven Software really run the whole show when it comes to creating the, the Battle Royale experience. So with 100 plus employees working on this secret mode, it's going to be something really big for Halo Infinite, and I would be shocked if it's not a Battle Royale. Rumor has it that it will be releasing at the end of 2023 as well. So likely they will be pretty quiet on what this mode actually is until most likely the next Xbox Bethesda showcase, which will happen in June of 2023. Of course, once we get some more information of what Certain Infinity is actually working on, you know I'll share it with you guys here on the channel. And talking about big announcements, looks like we have something happening this weekend on Sunday. If you guys want to know more about it, check out this video right here. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out.